there, this is Chad Garber. And in this video, I'm doing two product reviews. The first one is the Ernie Ball Power Peg. The second one is Elixir OptiWeb Super Light Guitar Strings. So I'm gonna do a review and a slight demo with this. And so if you like this video and other videos like it, please feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel to see more. But first of all, you know, if you're like me, I hate restringing guitars. It's just, uh, it's, my, it's my least favorite thing to do as far as guitar playing is concerned. Um, I just like to play. But, you know, today I was playing and boom, a string popped off and I had to restring the whole guitar. Now, you know, you're not supposed to, you could just replace one string, but technically you're supposed to replace them all. When you break one, you're supposed to replace them all. You can get away with doing it the other way, but especially if you're trying out a new set of strings, you definitely want to replace them all. So I went ahead and replaced them all. And I used this tool that I got a long time ago. I don't remember the price of it. I'll, I'll put a link down here um, so you can buy it yourself or you can look at the price and everything. But this will save you so much time restringing guitars. You know, you, there's, there's basically three ways I can think of, to, you know, restring guitars. You can do it manually with your, with your fingers, and that takes, the, you know, a long, long time. You can also do it with that other tool, that little spinny thing. You, you put it in the tuning peg and you spin it around. It's got that little wheel and you spin it around and that's a way faster. But this is the third way or at least the third way of the three ways that I know and it is so much faster. I mean, you basically, you, you push, you got this little knob but this little um, button. You push it up, it goes one way. You push it down, it goes the other way. So if you want to untune or not untune, to unstring or restring. Loosen, tighten. And so, my review of this is that it is, I highly recommend it to anybody who ever has to restring their guitars. It saves so much time. You basically you put the string on, you put it in the tuning peg, and you go for it. You just, all you gotta do is hold your strings, hold the strings with your other hand, and go for it. Only, pro only not a problem of it, but only thing you gotta be, be careful of is not to break the string. It, it, it's never happened to me except for once. And that was when I was trying to, I wasn't really paying attention, I just was going on and on and on. So if you, just, if you don't pay attention and you keep on going, it'll break. But that's just, duh, that's nothing to do with this thing, that's just being me being stupid. So, I would highly recommend this. I don't remember the price, but I'll put the link down below and you, to see the product, you can see the price and you can buy it there too. And so again, I highly recommend this. I, mean, I don't remember it being very expensive at all and I remember, and I do know that it, over the years it saved me so much time, it's so much faster. Okay, so then the other thing is the strings. I've been using, I always like elixir strings because my fingers apparently seem to produce a lot of grease and dirt. And so other strings that I use, it seems they, they get all dirty and nasty and they, they, they don't work. But the elixirs, I have found they are, they stay clean. You know, even after I get done playing, I can just kind of scrape it off and there's nothing there. It, it stays clean. And so, and so they last so much longer. What I've been using is the, the Polyweb Super Light Guitar Strings. And so today, I just put on the OptiWeb Super Light Guitar Strings by Elixir. And so I'm just going to give a, go, do, go through a quick demo of what it sounds like um, and that kind of give you my, my uh, thoughts about it. So here's how it sounds. <laughs> Thank you. 
accent effects. <laughs> There's the demo. You know, I guess here's what here's what my, my thoughts are. I don't really notice a difference between the OptiWeb and the PolyWeb, to be honest with you. I don't. Maybe uh, I don't know. I don't really notice a difference. I mean, it feels it feels very much the same to me. Yeah, I mean it feels very much the same. So they sound great, but I think I don't really notice the difference too much between the PolyWeb and the OptiWeb. But I would recommend either string because they last so much longer than any other string I've ever used. The other strings always get dirty. These, these strings last a very, very, very long time. So I would recommend both strings, the Elixir PolyWeb, and again, I use the uh, Super Light, but whatever, whatever gauge, and, or the OptiWeb. Elixir. I, I recommend both of them. And I'll put links down there for some Elixir strings that you can buy and look at the prices and everything. And so that's it. That's the video. Thank you so much for watching. If you do like this, if you did like this video and other videos like this, please feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel to see more. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day jamming out.